Los Angeles. I emailed everyone at Kirog saying please let me in because I'm probably the biggest fan that they have. Pretty exciting. I'm excited to go in there and see them. So getting impatient. I am warming up for the Kevin and Bean breakfast. It's actually not breakfast time now. It's actually two in the afternoon. Today is our rehearsal day, one of only three days, which is ambitious. I figure with the amount of stuff that we sign, probably are diminishing our signatures worth on eBay down to under $10 on an item. It becomes all about like emotional value and not monetary value. So there's more signatures out here and there's no monetary value. To them. Gotta do a show. Kevin's gonna do an intro. Okay. And then you're gonna go from Kevin's intro, take a beat, walk on stage, we'll put your ears in now, walk on stage, and then start what I've done once Mike's comfy by the can. Alright? The world famous K Rock presents Kevin and Bean's Breakfast. Breakfast, breakfast with Lincoln Park. Hey guys, welcome. Welcome, welcome to the secret location. Oh, this is this is intimate. This is tiny. Yes it is. Ladies and gentlemen, Lincoln Park! Fantastic. Lincoln Park, guys, right here. Pretty cool, right? Well, good morning, guys. Great to see you again. We've been uh, keeping in touch you. with you since Minutes to Midnight came out, but uh, man, how crazy, what a juggernaut this <laughs> album is. I mean, you worked on it a long time. You knew it was good. You expected it to be popular, but this is insane, right? It's weird. Right? Yeah, you know, I mean, we just try to do our best, you know, every time we go in the studio and, and write the best songs we can, and we just hope our fans will, will enjoy it as much as we do. And because we have the best fans in the world, I mean, they always support us with everything that we do, and, and they came out full force on this record. It was, it was amazing. Who's next? Nick from East LA. If you weren't musicians today, what would you be doing? I know that Chester used to work at Burger King, right? I used to work at Burger King. I was like, you know. Somebody worked at a bowling alley. Which one of you guys worked Chester at also alley? worked at a coffee house. I was, I'm a barista. I'm an official a barista. barista. What did you do? You had to have I, a bad job. Just, we were actually at the Roxy last night because we did a Battle of the Bands for Project Revolution, which was really cool. Right. Um, and I was, I'm, I'm always so excited when I go back to the Roxy because I actually used to work there. Really? So, and, and people always laugh for some reason when I tell them what my job was. You're a bouncer? I was the bouncer. <laughs> <laughs> How did, Sorry, what did you do there? That was really my no, job. No, you weren't a bouncer. I was I, kidding. That was my job. I was you were a bouncer. Mike G. On, yes. Mike G. Well, is this Mike G and Greco? For On the Rocks. I, I would stand in front of the big silver door and I, with a clipboard and I would, you know. I just thought, what's the least thing he would probably have done? I'd say bouncer. I don't know why everyone finds that so funny. Well, you're not exactly <laughs> built like a bouncer. Uh, what about Joe? Things? They want to find out about Joe. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, Mr. Han. What about your jobs? I used, I used to um, do parking at Dodger Stadium. Actually, that was, a, that was a good job. Would you have hung on to that job if the, if the band didn't come along? Would you still be there? No, I'd be a world champion mixed martial artist. <laughs> well, good luck with that. All right. Then. How great has Linkin Park been here this morning, by the way? <laughs> Seriously, all of you guys for showing up, doing this for us. Man, it's been so much fun. We really appreciate it. And, of course, Project Revolution is coming to town. It'll be here before you know it at the end of this month at the Hyundai Pavilion. Tickets are on sale now. Chester, real quick, who's the lineup for folks who maybe haven't heard who's on the project uh, this year? Well, this year we have uh, My Chemical Romance, Taking Back Sunday, Him, Placebo, Julian K. Those are the main stage acts. Uh, on, on the Revolution stage, we have Mindless Self-Indulgence, uh, Seosin, The Bled, Styles of Beyond, and Medina Lake. That's a, that's a day right there. You gonna play uh, one more to take us out here today? Let's do a little Bleed It Out. Yeah! Breakfast with Lincoln Park on K-Rock. Mike, 
I just have you follow me around all day and film me, no one actually will come up and bother me and talk to me because they're afraid of messing up the shot. Dude, he is so the man. Come on. <laughs> Apparently that's not going to work. Oh, I'm sorry, did I mess it up? <laughs> no, perfect. Oh, dude.